Hey, it's Alicia here, and today I wanted to talk about how to kill bad habits. And this is going to seem really simple, but it can make a huge difference. And essentially that is having more compassion and forgiving yourself if you do something that you think is like destructive or like wrong. Um, if you can find a way to love yourself even more and maybe even celebrate it, or just have more compassion for yourself, then that actually helps you to stop doing that thing when you stop being hard on yourself for continuing to do something or not do something, if you know what I mean. Um, so like for example, let's say you are trying to eat healthy, but then you kind of slip up and you eat some cakes, some cupcakes, or something really fattening, and you're upset with yourself for it, and then you find that you kind of just keep eating unhealthy. If instead, when you, you know, I guess sort of slipped up and maybe ate something you felt like you shouldn't have, just have compassion for yourself and forgive yourself. And if you can find a way to love yourself even more when you do these kind of destructive things, it just changes your frequency and makes a huge difference and you'll find that you actually will start doing that thing less when you have compassion for yourself. And that, in my opinion, is why cheat days work so well. It's because on that day that you didn't eat healthy, you weren't hard on yourself for it. You you actually were willing to even celebrate it. Like, yeah, I'm going to really enjoy this unhealthy food. You kind of looked at it in a completely different way. And that's why people who have cheat days don't um, kind of just slip up after their cheat day and then on the next day, you know, stop following their diet. They actually usually follow their diet even if they have their cheat days because they don't think of them as a slip up day. They they are willing to celebrate the fact that they ate something unhealthy. And that makes a huge difference in your difference in your frequency and that's that helps to really kill bad habits. So the next time that you do something destructive or you think you shouldn't have done, it's a bad habit, just forgive yourself for it and have more compassion for yourself and um don't think of it as if you're slipping up. Just try and celebrate like yeah, I did this today, and I'm just going to celebrate that I did it today, you know? And it can make a huge difference. So, simple trick. I know it seems maybe too simple to actually work, but try it out. Just try to forgive yourself every time you think you've slipped up. So, that's it for today, and I'll see you in the next video.